This is meteorologist Mark Molnar, your host for the weather show, Weather Northeastern. Let's get right into viewers sending photos and videos. We have a very spring-like weather pattern and possible severe weather to talk about into the Easter weekend. But until then, let's take a look at Robert Stone's photos in his travels. Let's start it off here with uh, up and through portions of Indiana. Taking a look at going south here, take a look at the portions of the area looking very beautiful across the region. And as you can see, I've slide through a lot of his photos here. He sent in tremendous amounts of photos and you can see very beautiful snapshots here from the Indiana region across this area, southern Indiana. Now if you take a look going south into portions of the, the, the sunsets were very beautiful in Indiana as well and so were the landscapes. You get right into Alabama you can see look at this very flat and very rolling across the area. Look at those crystal clear blue skies along these causeways. And let's head right up to Michigan, where his travels are taking him all over the place here in Michigan. Gobler, Michigan, I believe, tree farm. Take a look at this tree farm here across this region of Michigan. Very beautiful, to say the least, and he even had an included video here. So thank you, Robert, for sending in all your photos and videos on your nice travels here. And it looks like you haven't really ran into any very bad weather like a couple weeks ago. Let's head right into the forecast, starting off with your precipitation totals across the country. Your eyes drawn to the central portion. Yes, you will get some out west, but it'll be lighter. But look at this, right here in the plains, this is where we'll start with some severe thunderstorms that will progress to the east-northeast here. And I'll show you some of the portions of the northeast here get, it could get on in the act of some marginal risk of severe thunderstorms for Easter Sunday. Let's get right into the forecast, starting off with your snowfall totals. Not much to speak of here. Ice, pretty much a non-existent factor as well. I'll phase these maps out seasonally here and take a look here. River levels across the upper Susquehanna River Basin looking very good. Well below flood stage from Binghamton down to Scranton and Bloomsburg. Let's get right into the forecast starting off with your Friday TGIF. Many of you have this day off. Good Friday. Good day to have off. Look at this abundant sunshine. Yeah, we'll get some increasing clouds here towards Pittsburgh, Cleveland, Erie, Bradford, Warren, all the way through St. Mary's and State College down through Harrisburg and Lancaster and Lebanon. Here, portions of these areas will start to see the increasing clouds, but look at this. Temperatures really breaking out into the mid to high 60s, even some near 70 degree readings eclipsing here. Into Saturday, we move that warm front in, so we'll start to get an increase in clouds and showers and thunderstorms will be developing here across Pennsylvania portions of New York State, Southern Ontario. Temperatures will be on the increase as well. Temperatures soaring well into the 70s here as we get this warm air mass moving in. And of course, we'll erode even some of these 50s in favor of some 60s here. But look at this. Sharp cold front developing here. Portions of Easter Sunday across Southern Ontario, Northern Ohio, Southeastern Michigan. This will progress throughout the day. And we could see, especially in some of the red shaded areas here, of portions of northwest Pennsylvania, southwestern New York, central and western Pennsylvania, eastern Ohio. This is where we could get on the act middle portion of the day, even maybe portions of southern Ontario up here as well, into the strong to severe thunderstorm category. Main threat would be a large hail and damaging wind gusts, probably three-fourth inch in diameter or larger, and those wind gusts in excess of 60 miles per hour. Tornado threat looks a little bit marginal at this point. But nevertheless, look at temperatures breaking well into the 70s and even a lot of 80s developing here. So the air mass will be primed for some showers and thunderstorm activity. It won't be a massive widespread spread outbreak here, but we'll see probably marginal to slight risk in some of these areas here. As this progresses throughout the day, the severe will start to... Uh, push into portions of the Susquehanna River Valley into the Hudson River Valley towards evening of your Easter Sunday. Heading on into Monday, that all sweeps off the coast here and we get cold, cool Canadian high here, but it will still be into the 50s and lower 60s, which is very nice and those northwest winds develop. Take a look at the extended outlook here for my hometown viewers from Binghamton to Scranton's upper Susquehanna region of upstate New York and northeast Pennsylvania. Look at this beautiful weather. Sunny in the mid to high 60s for your good Friday into Saturday. Yes, we do have increasing clouds, chance of a shower, a thunderstorm, especially in the afternoon, heading up towards the upper 60s again into your Easter Sunday. Watch out for a few strong thunderstorms. Sun will be out, but also later in the day we could see some strong thunderstorms. Temperatures will head up towards 80 
And then for your Monday and Tuesday, much colder, well, I should say cooler, but still near 60 degrees. Clearing out. That's going to do it for this edition of Weather Northeastern. Don't forget to like me on Facebook at MediaMark. Subscribe to me on YouTube at MediaMark.com. It's MediaMark.com and WeatherNortheastern.com. Twitter at WX Northeastern. That's going to do it for this edition of Weather Northeastern.